Hello everyone, my name is Darren Thing Cap and welcome back to Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. Anyways, so apparently our koala duelist friend of Australia just last won his graduation and now is proceeding his dream job. But now it's time for the graduation match. Let's get started. Once again, Zane Truzia proved to be the highest scoring duelist at Duel Academy, having the top rank here in the X to choose his opponent in his graduation duel. Congrats, Zane, you've done it again. You've gotten the highest score in the school. And you know what that means. You you win the honor of being the headliner in Duel Academy's prestigious graduation match. Why thanks. And tradition dictates that you get to pick whoever you want as your opponent. So who will it be, Zane? Who will I duel? The one, only one worthy. It's time to give Jaden his rematch. It was soon time for the graduation match. Jaden looks serious. That's gotta be a first. I wonder if he's nervous. He ought to be. Alright, Zane, I guess... I guess may the best duelist win. Enough small talk. Let's do this. Oh, he's serious. Jin in his rematch. Yeah, I was actually disappointed. Like, how could you not keep your key card? Gig, gate key, whatever. Mm hmm. So, let, prepare to get sec to get death. Get your game on. Accelerize. Time to duel. Did it, did it, did it, duel. Alright. Alright, so I'll uh, put one mustache uh, face down. I got like nothing but monsters. Okay, well, in this kind of I can take all Siren. Okay. That's one card face down. Two card fa face down cards. <laughs> Lovely. Mm hmm. Anything interesting? Just that. Uh, I'm gonna hit this down. I'm gonna put this down. Uh huh. I'll let you go with that for now. Hmm. What does this do again? Send any number of spell attack cards you control to the graveyard. How about... No. Mm -hmm. It says spell attack cards I control. I control them. It better not be the one I'm thinking of, because if that's how that works, I'm going to be very upset. Okay. Ugh. I just end my turn, I guess. No. Go away, card. Alright, he's gonna use polarization, I suppose. At some point, he wants to use polarization. Uh, no. Now I'm just gonna put you, set you down because you're annoying me. Then I activate Pot of Greed. Okay, Cyclone Boomerang gets 500 attack points. Alright, there's that then. Battle Guard Rage. Alright. Wild Heart. That should be at 2000, is it? This monster attacks again. Alright, so. Now, I shouldn't be able to be affected 
Are you kidding me? Wait, ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me with that. That's bull honky. Okay, activate the target. You can control one. No, I don't want to activate that. That doesn't need no good at all. Ugh. Nope. So he's got polymerization. That's more than I can say for myself. Nope. Nope. No. Uh, you know what? Screw this. Can I just use that? Yeah, that'll be, that'll be fine. Just to get rid of that annoying car. Sheesh. End my turn. So far, very boring. Alright, so he's got that. He's gonna use barbarization. Fusing all his little Saibi dragons. Well, this lance was like, oh god, that makes sense. Yep, yeah, that's out. Also, goodbye. Peace. Of course. Why the heck not, right? Sheesh, why do I keep getting these cards? Come on, give me something good. What did you just do? Alright, well. Wait. Um, can I get a Clayman in defense mode? Oh, uh, Wild Heart. Sit down. Ah, oh, shoot, I could've just... Oh, I'm an idiot. I could've summoned Blade Edge. And not been totally stupid. Gosh darn, I've ruined the entire duel already. <sighs> Gosh darn it, I'll be back as I, I messed up. If I was paying attention, I could have just summoned a stronger monster, but no, I had to be an idiot. I <laughs> so mean to myself. <sighs> I'm so tired. I honestly just start recording the Metal Gear, uh, Video um, right after I got out of the shower from coming back from like the two jobs that I have now for like a little while, and I'm very tired. Ugh, so tired. Mm -hmm. Why am I getting all these vicinity tricks? Why are the li oh gosh, I, sh I knew he was gonna do that too. Give me a polymerization, you piece of crap. I don't care. Uh, let's not go on. Well! Okay, you know what? I'll, I'll be back. This duel's being a bunch of junk. Giving me three Bacinatrixes off the bat? What kind of game is this? What kind of sick joke is that? Come on. There we go. That's better. Do that, so 
What do we got here? Uh, let's get play with this one. Uh huh. I don't I think things through well enough, do I? Apparently not. I'm gonna take a nap now. Well, I wait for my doom. Can only w wait. What's going on? They're stirring them cyber dragons. They're stirring it. Uh... Oh, okay, that's lovely. I don't have a single card for this, do I? I don't believe I do. Okay. Flame Man. Flame Man. Let's get Versinatrix. I think I have something for this. Maybe. 4,000. Oh, this could help. The warrior returning alive. All right, now let's fusion. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait. I... Wait, did I put in the fence? Gosh darn it. I just keep messing up everything I do. Okay, fusion summons something else then. Okay, so I can bring two of these. Put you in defense mode. Then I end my turn. Yes. The duel ended in a draw! Wait, that doesn't count as a win though. So, we have to do it again! I just thought that'd be fun to do. Nice card, though. That was a perfect little win right there, even though I still technically lost. A lot of hell, a lot of life points, though. Sheesh. You can see what that one card would have done from here from earlier. All right, let's try Graceful Charity. See where that gets us. Oh, great, Future Fusion. So I'm gonna get rid of Avion, and I'm gonna get rid of this one. All right, what do I got here? Here's your fusion. All right. Percentatrix. Claymans. All right. I'm gonna put down me a bubble boy. A bubble boy. Bubble butt. Bubble bu 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 bubble butt. Bubble butt. Of course, he's gonna summon a stupid monster like that. What an idiot. Here we go, boys. Oh, I need that fusion monster. would be nice.
Oh gosh, I would get Clayman immediately after that. So, I should probably actually save them. Uh, I knew I should have stuck you guys. Yeah, but I didn't listen to myself. I didn't listen to the high of the cards. Oh, my damage! Oh, no! Now I got nothing to show for it. Other than this. Future sh fusion. In defense mode. That will show everyone. Not. And I can't attack. Wait, was it? Oh, I can attack direct. Wait. D fusion. I'll be back, guys, when I beat this guy. Alright, guys, just the moment of truth. Sorry if I sound tired. I'm just exhausted. Anyways, thank you, Wild Edge, for being ever so helpful. Winner! Wow, Zane, you really got our great. I'm gonna miss ya. And now you, Jaden. That's why I'm passing you the torch. Once I leave here, you'll be the top student at this school. Despite your grades or your rank, you'll you'll be the best, so make me proud. I'm not sure how I feel about here like you just saying it like that. A new breed of hero. As soon as the sun was over, it was the start of Jaden's second year at Duel Academy. With one big change, Chancellor Shepard was called away for unknown reasons, so Dr. Krauss served as acting Chancellor. Aster Phoenix, not only is this superstar the top ranked duelist in the entire world, he's joined the freshman class of our very school. With a celebrity under my tutelage, I'll be famous. After all, everyone on Earth knows that a knows Aster Phoenix. Dr. Krauss didn't realize that Aster already arrived in the alley much earlier, so Crawler was left waiting at the docks. This doesn't make sense. He's a no-show. After Aster completely took o care of some business on the island, he returned to the big city to continue dueling professionally. Aster prepared for his du to duel the hottest pro duelist on the circuit, Zane Truesdale. Before the duel, Aster met with his agent, Sinister Kumar. What's up? I wish you'd spend less time on your juvenile games than time preparing for your duels. You're on the heels of the greatest challenge of your life. Please, you know I'll win. Yes, the cards to do predict victory. Our Zane is merely one step towards your very destiny. True destiny. Any chance you're gonna tell me what my destiny might be? No, but you'll still find out in due time. Until then, you must put your complete faith in me. After your battle with Zane, you must return to Duel Academy where you'll duel Jade and Yuki to a duel. But first things first, your public awaits. Yeah, I got a big night ahead. After Aster defeated Zane, he announced his next opponent would be Jade and Yuki. Back at Duel Academy, Jade and Aster faced off. All right, time to loosen your tie, roll up your sleeves, and get your game on. Please, I won't even break a sweat. You're going down, man. Well, there's one way to find out. Let's do this. And I have no idea. I do what, uh, what am I doing? Wait. Oh yeah, I am. I am, I am a Phoenix. Oh, I'm exhausted from work. <laughs> I'm still kicking up strong. Keeping strong. All right. He has very interesting duel. I mean, then we have like the evil heroes. Shining Phoenix Enforcer. Oh, that's the hero Phoenix Enforcer. Oh no, he just has these weird things. Okay. Alright, so he has it. Wait. So. Phoenix and four. Elements of Hero Phoenix, four elements of Hero Spark Bam. Avion must be. cannot be special summoned by this. Same trick, so. Phoenix Enforcer. So I'll, I'll activate this. Diamond Dude. <laughs> Diamond Dude. Got a cut. Uh, where's this Phoenix Destiny Hero? Well, 
Wait, where is this one thing? Um, Phoenix Enforcer guy. Hmm, not seeing him. Oh well. Wait, what was this card do? Um, what was Misfortune do again? Select. Alright, so I'll just put this card face down and just end my turn. Woo! Fusion Gates. Lovely. That's helpful. Does he have Avion? Oh, what do you know? I was right. Oh, Avion, I mean, Flame Wingman, that's what I meant to say. He does! That'll be fun. Misfortune, select one monster, deflect. Alright, let's do that. Then I'm gonna use your field card. Activating it. The summon Elemental Hero Phoenix Enforcer. Wait a minute. Phoenix Enforcer. Doesn't that mean... I should... be able to summon this. down and it's attack but well, I can't attack why well, can't I attack yeah you better stay away from my deck Here, well, I was not able to attack. me. You, if you know what's good for you, if you know what's good for you, city. Okay, here then. Um, when, when an attack here, you control dark. Let's see here. When my graveyard. Alright, so when an elemental hero. So if I flip this. This card is now. And flip this. Flip this. Attack. Attack. Alright, and then... And then that. Haha! <laughs> I thought that that was card was really gonna do me any good, but, you know. Hey, whatever. Terraform. Fusion Gate, and I don't even know. 
I don't I just know I don't need that card. Let's activate it. Attack. Attack. And attack. Got nothing to protect yourself. Uh. All right. Well, let's attack with Elemental Hero, Shining Phoenix Enforcer. Sorry, Jaden, but I win. Your dueling skills may not be half bad. However, there's something I have you'll never have: purpose. A real duel, a, re a reason to duel besides having fun. What else is there? The reason I duel is to bring justice to the world and by punishing people who think they're above the law. Uh, come again? I'm guessing the explanation. My father was a duelist, too. He worked as a car designer for Maximilian Pegasus. My dad put his heart in every design he created. He was my hero. What happened? Some punk took him away. He, he broke into our house. And now he's gone. That's awful. Hold up. Did your dad design... That's right. My father designed... Created the Destiny Heroes. They were the last cards he ever made. My father taught me that justice would always prevail. But he was wrong. Justice is a lie. They still haven't found my dad. And whoever took him away is still out there. I'll... I duel to bring lawbreakers to justice. And in honor of my father, I use the very cards he created to punish these evil doers. And Sunday, I'm gonna find the scum that kidnapped my father and make him pay for what he did. I'll know I, I know him as soon as I see him because he'll have a rare card, the one he stole when he took my dad. It was the last card my father made. Whoever has is gonna regret the day he was born. What card was that? And uh, pretty sure I know who it was too. Anyways, that's all the time I have for today. I'm actually quite exhausted for some reason. Uh, so I will tip my cap off to you guys now, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.